This is a tutorial on how to set up a Smart Pro Switch with Netgear's Insight. First, type in the IP address of the switch into your search bar, or enter the IP address assigned by your router into the search bar. This will take you to the local web interface for the device. Once you get here, click Advanced and click Proceed. It will take you to a login page. Log into your Netgear account, or you can create a Netgear account if you don't already have one. Enter your email address and password. Once it opens, you'll see a notice. Read through the notice and click OK. If you have any of these four models of switch, before you can enable your switch with Insight, you're going to have to update. Go click on the Maintenance tab, then click on Update, then click HTTP Firmware File Update. Then you have to go download the update information from Netgear's website. Go into your search bar and type in the model of your switch, followed by firmware. Find the Netgear support page, click on it. These steps apply to all the Netgear Smart Manage Pro switches with Insight Management capability. Here we are using the GS110 TPP model as an example. Please go to Netgear Business Product website to see a full list of Insight Manageable Smart Manage Pro switches. Click Downloads. It will bring you down to a list of firmware. Open the latest firmware. Click Download. Click on the zip file after it downloads. Open the file. Copy the contents. And paste the contents into your Downloads folder. After this, Go back to the device local page, select the file by clicking browse, the .bix file, click open, it will upload the .bix file and click apply. After some time, it will have applied the update to your switch. Once this is done, go into your Insight mobile app. Let the mobile app load, and once it loads your locations, Click in the top right corner the plus sign. When you click the plus sign, select scan barcode. Scan the barcode on the back of your switch to enter the serial number for you. Select the right location. Now the switch is registered successfully. If you would like to manage it with Insight Cloud, please go ahead and click Manage with Insight. If you want to manage it locally for now, please choose Not Now, and you're done with device registration. If you selected Manage with Insight, continue watching. If you're going to proceed with Not Now, you can go ahead and move to 4 minutes and 15 seconds. After clicking Manage with Insight, you have to go back into the local GUI, read the notice, click OK. In the top, it'll have Management Mode. Switch it to Netgear Insight, read the alert, click OK, click Apply, read the next alert, and click OK. This will redirect you to the login page. Now go back into your mobile app, Click Yes Continue. After clicking Yes Continue, you'll be prompted to rename your device. Once you rename your device, click Next, then click OK, and after some time, your device should reboot. During this time, you can click View Devices to return to the device list. In the device list, you'll see your device waiting for First Connect. After just a few minutes, it should connect to the Insight Cloud and show up in your Insight device list as connected. Selecting the device opens the device menu. In the device menu, you can see that you have full control and monitoring capabilities of the device through Insight. If instead you want to manage your device locally, go back to the local interface, click OK on the notice, switch it to Direct Connect to Web Browser Interface, read the alert, click OK, and click Apply. It will redirect you to the login page where you can log in and manage your device locally. No other change is needed. If instead you selected Not Now, it will finish registering your device to the account. Click View Devices to return to the device list where after a moment of loading, you should see the switch with limited support capabilities. Clicking on the device menu shows that you have limited control and view through Insight. This is because you've selected to manage it locally. If you want to switch to Management with Insight, select the blue Manage with Insight. It will bring you to a new page in the app that will prompt you to go back to the browser interface. Returning to the browser interface, read the notice, click OK. In the top left, switch it to Netgear Insight mobile app. Read the alert, click OK, click Apply, and click OK to be brought back to the login screen. 
You don't need to log in again, just return back to your mobile app. In the mobile app, select Yes Continue. After a moment of loading, it'll prompt you to rename your device. After renaming your device, click Next, then click OK, then click View Devices to return to the device list. In the device list, your switch will be waiting for First Connect. After a few minutes, it should show up as connected in the device list. Selecting the device will open the device menu, where you can see all the options and control that Insight gives you. That's all. Thank you for watching.